me just get this straight for a second. So if she's your sister and you made a prank where you got her mom pregnant, wouldn't that make it your mom as well? Yo, what's going on YouTube, it's Ivan Steph and you guys. So if you saw my last video where we took a look at Kitty Cat Nuda Head who won't admit she's 12 or otherwise known as Danielle Khan, then you would probably remember this guy. Doesn't ring a bell? Well, let me show you a quick clip where he talks about how hot a child looks in an adult costume. Oh my god, Danny! She looks fantastic. Ooh! Are you gonna arrest somebody? Okay. Yeah, so for today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at this cheetah face Donald Trump looking ass guy named Sebastian Balls. Now this guy is famous for... Actually, I I really don't know why he's famous. I don't know. I think him and Donald Trump went to the same tanning salon or something and hooked up. Anyway, so I was taking a look at this guy's feed on YouTube, and then I saw one of the video titles had James Charles in it, and I'm like, yo, I love me some sisters. I gotta check this out. Yeah, so I clicked on the video, and apparently he's out to destroy James Charles' career because he made a video titled, Destroy My Little Sister James Charles' Palette. She cries. Yeah. Now honestly, what an asshole, because I can guarantee you that there are a lot of sisters out there who wish that they could get their hands on this sold out palette, but instead this pumpkin looking ass destroys it for no reason. Alright, so we're just gonna dive straight into the video like this girl here. Swimmers, take your mark. Go! But just before we do, if you guys can leave a like on the video and subscribe if you haven't already, it really would mean a lot. Yo, what is up my boys and girls? How are you today? Yo, what is up? I literally don't think you guys are ready for this video. I definitely do not think that you are ready for this video. I am going to be doing yet another prank on the Danielle Cohn. Yes, she is like my little sister, even though she is not really my sister. We're just like really close. We live together. We're roommates. We make content together and we work together. So you're sisters, but you're... Uh... All right, I, I don't really know what you're trying to say here, but like, we'll roll with it. We're super close, and to be honest, I just think it'd be super funny if I pulled another prank on her. The last prank that we pulled on her was uh, this, and- Whoa, 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 hold up a second. I got your mom pregnant prank? Were you just saying that Danielle is your sister? All right, let me just get this straight for a second. So if she's your sister, and you made a prank where you got her mom pregnant, wouldn't that make it your mom as well? Today, we are going to be breaking Danielle Cohn's James Charles palette. As you may know, the whole scandal within my really good friend Lauren, yeah, she destroyed the palette for kicks and giggles and um, it didn't go too well. James got offended. All right, so you just said that your friend did this before, which got James Charles super offended, yet you're doing the same thing? All right, yeah, this guy really is an asshole. And you may be asking, did Danielle buy this palette herself? No, she did not. I'm actually going to be surprising her with a James Charles palette because she does not have one, but she does want one. Wow, ladies, can we just pause for a second and just take a look at how sweet Sebastian Bales is? He's buying the makeup palette, which Danielle really wants giving it to her and then destroying it. Ladies, this here is husband material. You know, this guy's just so romantic that he would do something like buy a wedding ring, go down on one knee, slowly put it up your finger and then smash her hand with a hammer. I just thought this would be the perfect opportunity just to like get her back because there have been times where she's pranked me and I just, I just wanna get her back, you know? 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 Jeez, all right, man, relax. Yeah, judging by what you said in the last video and the way you raised your eyebrows, I'm sure you would enjoy giving it to her from the back. Also, I was going to get her the James Charles palette for Christmas, but it was actually sold out at the time. Everyone was buying them for Christmas, but now they are actually back in stock. Well, let's hope they're back in stock. And I'm gonna be buying not one, but two palettes because the first one I'm going to surprise her with and that's the one that I'm gonna break. The second one is gonna be the one to make up for breaking it. So so she actually does have a James Charles palette because that'd be really, 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 really messed up of me if I just like broke the palette and was just like, well, it's broken, enjoy it. Yeah, and it's still really messed up of you to do because you know that those have a habit of going out of stock. And it could be down to the last two in the store and there's a little sweet girl named Susie who really wants that palette and has been waiting months for it, but you run in there like you say bull and are like, yeah, sorry, this is kind of more important because I actually need two so I can smash one of them for an extremely hilarious prank. Because she didn't think I didn't get her two, but then I did get her two, but then she actually only has one, so like, 
yeah. Give this video a big thumbs up for all the pain that Danielle is going to go through today within this prank. And do not forget to leave a comment down below. I, I want you guys to comment if I got her good. Like, let me know. Did I get her good? Like, keep watching the video and then comment below if I got her good. Let's see how good I pranked Danny this time. Did you think it was good? I think, was it? I don't know. Was it good though? Was it good? Was it good? Don't forget to tell me if it's good because if you forget, that's going to be bad and like, that's not going to be good. So without further ado, let's get started within this prank. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> All right, yo guys, so um, I'm back from the Morphe store. Fun fact, they actually had it in stock, which I was so, 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 so happy about. Wow, um, this guy is really happy. Here they are, the two um, James Charles palettes. Yes, they're both real. You can make fake ones. Apparently they're fake ones. I don't really know, but these are these two are apparently are real. All right, so I didn't mention it before, but how does this guy not notice how out of focus the video is? Like he's literally staring into the viewfinder and he still can't see how out of focus it is. I'm like, what's up with the saturation of the video? You can't even see the name of the palette. This one does not, oh my gosh. Yo, guys, this one has packaging and this one doesn't have packaging. Like this one has like the foam pieces into it. Like it's soft and then this one doesn't like it's like sketchy sketch oh wow bro that is like super sketchy like you could open that thing up and like there could be a bomb in there like this could be another almost assassination attempt with the mexicans thinking that you're donald trump i guess i have to do it myself i know it's not <laughs> okay guys relax i'm kidding it was just a joke He's too orange to look like Donald Duck. Actually, I've never wrapped a gift, so let's hope I can do it well. I've seen people do it, but I don't know if I can. Let's All right, so basically for the next minute of the video, it's really weird. He turns into an ASMR channel and tries to turn on the viewers by wrapping up the gift as he whispers how Lightning McQueen fast he is. I don't know, it sounds like he's trying to sound sexy and it's, it, it, it's just really weird. Wow, look at me go. I'm so fast. I'm so fast. Look at me go, I'm so freaking fast. I am literally Lightning McQueen, like come on. <laughs> All right, there we have it. This is the wrapped James Charles palette. And I know she's super excited and she really wants it. She's gonna be super excited when I give it to her. But the second I start breaking it, she's gonna like literally be so sad. But like I mentioned before, it's okay if we break this one because we have this one. So I'm not too mean, you know? Like I'm not that mean, but I, I mean, I'm mean, but like I'm not that mean. Oh yeah, yeah, it's okay. Just, I mean, just forget about poor little Susie. Probably crying in her bed because you wouldn't let her take the last James Charles palette. Actually, wait, hold on, okay? I need you guys to stop what you're doing right now and Drop a pray for Susie in the comment section down below because this girl, this guy ruined her day and she she did not need that. And poor little Susie, poor Susie. So leave a comment down below saying pray for Susie and let's let's try to make her day. All right, let's go. All right, guys, here's the Morphe bag and she's literally downstairs. I'm gonna go down there and give it to her. Here it is. Here we go. Let's go surprise her and break her heart, but also surprise her again and not break her heart. Bro, go already. I'm tired of waiting. Do it. Danny, where are you? I have something for you. Danny, look what I got you. So here you go. All right, yeah, um, proceeds to hit her with the bag. Open it up. <gasps> You're joking. <laughs> I'm literally, I've been wanting this for so long. I, no, I'm so excited. I get to do makeup. I get to look good. Yeah. Wow. 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 Can, can, can we just really... Prankster of the Year Award goes to Sebastian Bale. Woo! You know, that really wasn't as entertaining as I thought it would be. I, I thought it would be a little different. I thought she would, he would do a little more than really just simply give her the palette because that's, that's not much of a prank. Okay guys, so much success. She was so excited that she got the James Charles palette, but now it is time to destroy her dream. Okay. I'm gonna go check on her and see if she's using the palette and if she's loving it and we're going to crush her dreams. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm using it as my cabin using like the brown colors and I'm trying to find like the perfect shade for tomorrow. Oh my gosh. Are you loving it? Is it like everything you dreamed of? Is it like yeah. the dream palette? You like it? Yeah. Isn't this so cute? You know, I don't understand how Danielle doesn't find it suspicious at all with this guy following her with a giant camera in his hands. Like does she really think he's just filming a normal video so they could like look back at this in like 10 years, kind of like baby photos? Oh my god, I'm dumb. What? I forgot my new brushes. Should I go get them? Yeah, definitely. Go try it out. And then you can use the palette with the nice. new brushes, you know? All right, I'll be waiting here. Okay, guys. So I got, I got the, this right here. Wait. 
You're telling me that he had this giant thing bulging in his pants this whole time and she didn't see it? I mean, what even is that? Is that a hammer? I mean, I, I fucking hope to God that that's a hammer and not his... Yeah. Right here. And, um, we're gonna destroy it, so... Oh. I hope that this guy adds unnecessary music to the video, like he's filming the sequel to a horror movie. Like, why? We already knew you had the hammer in your pocket to begin with. I'm just giving you some advice. It kind of defeats the purpose of a jump scare. Let's destroy it. You know, it can't get any faker than this. <laughs> Doesn't it look what so do pretty? Huh? Let's just pause the video for a sec and zoom up on her face real quick. That is a smile. It, it, you know, it doesn't really look like Danielle is actually pissed off with this. And and wait, is Mikey recording too? Hey, hold on a second. You're telling me that Mikey Tua? Danielle Khan's boyfriend knew about this genius Einstein prank the whole time. My mind is blown. No. What's wrong, Danny? Okay, wait, hold on. Are we gonna appreciate how she dropped that bucket of brushes on the floor and only one fell out? Wow, like that's actually probably the coolest part about the video so far. It's just a palette. It's just some. It looks so much prettier. It literally looks so much prettier like that. Oh, she's Yo. mad. Oh my god, Yo. she's so Yo. mad. I'm like shaking. I actually. Bro, should we go chase after her? Yeah. Danny. Why does Mikey look high every time he appears in the video? Like he's kind of just there and is like, dude, yeah. You right, you right. We should go after her. Like she might go on a rampage and like run out of the house. Dude, what did she do? Oh. Whoa, what did you do? Danny, stop running. Danny, it's just a pallet. Oh my god, Danny. Hey, oh, oh, what's going on? What's up with the camera? Where, where is she running? Where is she gonna go? Is she gonna run a couple houses down and then go run out the house, go buy a shotgun and bah, bah. Oh, oh, oh. And, oh, oh, and you, you know, shoot Sebastian balls in the balls. So then Sebastian balls and Sebastian no balls. Is that what's gonna happen? Pro no, no, she's probably gonna run out of oxygen, go, uh, uh, and then turn right back around, go apologize and be like, I'm yeah. sorry, you know. And there's the video. Yeah. And again, this is unnecessary dramatic for no reason. Like if you had some cheesy horror music throughout the whole video, it would literally look like the sequel to Scary Movie. Yo, what is up my boys and girls? I am going to be doing yet another prank on the Danielle Cohen. Hey! What's wrong? It literally looks so much prettier like that. Danny, it's just a palette. Oh my God, Danny. All right, so basically what happens next is Sebastian gives the second pallet to her boyfriend, Mikey, and then they decide it would be a good idea to put it in his hoodie because they'll hug and she'd be like, ooh, what's that? And then, <laughs> voila, happy ending. Like, why would you do that? Now, like, they're probably sold out. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Well, you know what would make you feel better? Mikey always makes you feel better. I think you should just hug him. Yeah, like, that's not creepy at all to go up to this 12-year-old with your giant camera and gorilla pod and tell her that it would be a good idea for her to hug her boyfriend. Like, Do you feel anything? And not that kind of feel, Danny. Whoa, wait, what's going on? Boy, I swear if this couple don't- Oh God, whoa. <laughs> what is that? I got you oh, two. Oh, I mean, one's broken, but now you have another oh, one. Oh my there you go. You have your palette and I won't you break it. Break. I do apologize. I just thought it'd be super funny. It's a funny video and you got pranked. So, <laughs> you got pranked. Wow, j j just- 10 out of 10 Rotten Tomatoes. Definitely would recommend. Prank of the Year Award goes to Sebastian Bales. Wow. All right, I'm not even gonna lie. My expectations weren't too high for a video. I mean, like a guy who looks like an orange and a company with Danielle Kahn and Mikey Tua. I, I knew how this video would be trash to begin with and that's exactly why I reacted to this, so. 
Anyway, guys, that's gonna do it for this video, and I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. What did you guys think of this video? I'll leave a comment down below on what you guys think. Woo, 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 woo. I I keep clapping every. I gotta calm down, bro. I'm too hyped up. Guys, 2019 grind has started. We are on our third video within a week and a half, and we are flying high this year. So if you guys haven't subscribed already, make sure to subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. 200,000 subscribers by the end of 2019, and 100,000 subscribers by my birthday on June 5th. We're reaching there, so if you guys want to be part of the family, make sure to subscribe, leave a like on the video, join the family. I want a family. I really want to build this from the bottom up, and by the end, I want to have a true family. I want to be able to interact with all of my fans. But anyway, guys, until next time, it's been Ivan Steph. Peace. Why you got a war like that? I'm telling y'all. Bitch cool, out of paper tag. I'm telling y'all. Shorty say she like my swag.